tonight we saw Scandalous. This is the story of Amy Semple McPherson, and she was a Pentecostal evangelist in the 20s and 30s. She started a church in Los Angeles in the Hollywood area that's still there today. This story is called Scandalous because this was a woman who was supposed to be preaching about the Bible and religion, so to speak. She had some very handsome young men working with her and for her who people felt she was having an affair with. She was as famous then as Madonna was in the 80s. She was a very strong woman and strong-willed and had envisioned herself and sold herself as a brand. And I think probably the uh, evangelicals of today took some lessons from her. Carolee Carmelo plays Amy, and she blew me away. The first time I heard her voice, I got chills. Every time that girl sang, I got chills. She be embodies Amy, and she has this voice that doesn't quit. She is tremendous. Roz Ryan plays Emma Jo. She is a woman who run a, ran a brothel in Kansas City. She was his phenomenal. She was hysterical. She has a great voice. She has great comedic timing. And she was playing a character that just wouldn't take anything off of anybody. I love the music. I thought the music was rocking. I mean, it was very gospel oriented and it was very loud. And it just made you feel alive. The music was used to carry the plot. So everything, that, everything was sung. And a uh, very little dialogue between the characters. It's almost an operetta because it just keeps on going all the way through, but I have to tell you, the, all of it sounded the same to me, unfortunately. The show was a little bit long, but I went, at the end when it was over, I was ready for it to be over, but it didn't, I didn't feel it during the, the beginning and the middle. It was just, I didn't wa look at my watch, not even one time. The show in general, I felt, um, was, needs some work. Carol Lee Carmela's performance makes it absolutely worth seeing the show. I might not recommend this to a friend because it's a very long show and you felt like you were running a marathon. I'm gonna tell everybody to see this. I mean, it's, it was so much fun. Some of the songs and some of the scenes were so much fun, I just wanted to get up and dance. Despite any of the shortcomings that the show may have, being the length and the, the material that's crammed into it, there are some great performances, and it's really got a, a, a good feel to it, and it, it, it's really very entertaining.